Yeah, this is Matteo from Sporto Milano and today we're in Baggio, which is a municipality on the western side of Milan, more precisely in Via Ghiringhelli, in order to show you a whole apartment with kitchen, bedroom and a bathroom with one balcony, which is located on the ground floor, just a slightly elevated one. It is accessible through the door here with uh, just a few steps. So now let's just go ahead and let me show you around. So as you can see here we have the two doors and uh, this one leads to the apartment. On the right we find the kitchen while in front of us we have uh, the bathroom proceeding through the kitchen and the living area we also have the access to the balcony on that side and to the bedroom just uh, through this uh, pocket door so we can just uh, begin our tour uh, from here the whole apartment is uh, very luminous and uh, fully furnished with a modern uh, style the bedroom is a double one and it comes with a high window for natural light we do have the safety fences, as you can notice, as well as a mosquito net. We're overlooking the interior courtyard, so there's a lot of privacy and it's a nice and quiet surrounding. In the middle of the room we find this uh, large uh, double bed with its uh, two bedside tables yeah. built in drawers. We also have these uh, flexible lamps, which you can adjust for reading at night, and a colorful print right on top of it. While this uh, standalone uh, wardrobe has uh, huge sliding doors with built in uh, mirrors, we got racks here to hang your clothing and some uh, chests at the bottom. While that other one, besides having more shelvings inside, also hides the flat screen TV. So we do have uh, chest drawers underneath and uh, some more room to hang your clothing at the top, but you can enjoy that TV just uh, laying uh, on the bed on top of the door there you can notice we've got the air conditioning unit while as for the kitchen we do have a uh, living uh, side on this end uh, with this uh, colorful uh, blue couch and a little table on the side plus another colorful print right up here a second uh, air conditioning unit and there's uh, still a lot of natural light coming in both through the little window there, as well as this uh, French door, which uh, gives access to the private balcony. Even here we do have a safety gate. And uh, as you can notice, we're just on a slightly elevated floor. We're overlooking this uh, lovely courtyard with a nice tree right over there. There's uh, room for the rubbish underneath. There's even a barbecue right in that corner. Okay, nice and quiet surrounding. Well, as for the kitchen itself, here in the middle of the room we've got a square table which can also be extended so it can host more space. In these cabinets we find a freezer on the top as well as the fridge underneath. That's a fairly spacious one. In these drawers you're gonna find all the cutlery which is uh, provided with the department together with some more tools. While here at the bottom you'll find the pots. On the side here we have this uh, modern uh, looking uh, oven and on top of it we do have a get up and on an induction stove with the fan right on the top a cabinet up here where you can store the food and uh, another one on the side with the uh, glasses and uh, cups provided another one here for the food again while in this large one you can find all the plates mugs as well as the coffee machine there's also a kettle there for boiling the water, a large uh, sink, while here on the top you've got the rack to dry your plates after washing. At the bottom we have some uh, room for the rubbish, while in here we even find that uh, dishwasher. So a very fully equipped and modern kitchen. Even the kitchen can be separated through a pocket door. This is just the entrance hall with uh, another couple of uh, colorful prints and a uh, coat hanger. While through this door we access the bathroom in which we find first of all the box shower on the right with its uh, sliding doors so it's a very spacious one actually with the additional hooves uh, as well there's also a rack here which you can use to hang your towels or clothing to dry out that's the heating unit and underneath we find uh, both of the toilets the bathroom bidet the washing machine right in this corner and uh, hidden behind it we find the tools for cleaning the apartment, so the mop and the broom. This window, which is still facing the interior courtyard, again with the safety fences. And of course we have a large sink with its mirror on the top. 
and the cabinet underneath. As for the public transport, we do have the bus line number 58, which uh, connects you directly to Bisceglie, the terminal stop of uh, line number 1, in uh, pretty much 10-15 uh, minutes. So from there you can catch the underground line number 1 and go directly to the city center in uh, less than 20 minutes. So it's uh, still a very convenient uh, location. We're also very close to the Tangenziale Ovest, which is a quick access if you're coming by car. So we still have plenty of connection. And generally speaking, in Baggio you can still find uh, plenty of facilities, including some uh, shops and supermarkets. And with this, we showed everything. So thanks for watching and see you next time. <laughs> ciao, ciao.